So, you want to become a HGV driver, and why shouldn't you? It's a fantastic job. You get to drive big, shiny trucks on the open road, seeing the countryside. But it comes with a sort of a backlash that you're really going to have to get your head around. And I don't think new drivers really understand it. And a lot of it is, you know, the endless amounts of paperwork you have to do. The traffic is always going to be one, you know, you're going to miss things, you're going to be late, you're going to promise your loved ones, you know what, yeah, I'll be on an early one today, babe, I'll be back for four o'clock, book the restaurant for six. You ain't ever going to make it, so here you go. Because every now and then, you'll be stuck on a motorway, with the engine turned off, just staring into the abyss. So, what do you do? Well, you have to learn to adapt to these situations, you know. I've done kids' sports days, my kids, obviously, not just random children, but, you know, I've parked the lorry outside in the teacher's car park before, just to, you know, so I could run in and watch an assembly and things like that. But, yeah, you're just going to have to suck it up because they don't tell you all this. They'll take your money and go, yeah, we, we'll take on HGV drivers, but this is the reality. This is it. <laughs>